Hello guys, Sanjay here and as you can see I have the Redmi Note 3 over here with me and yes this Redmi Note 3 is rooted, the bootloader is unlocked and even the TWRP recovery is installed on this device and in this video I'll show you guys how to update your device from a lower version of MIUI to a higher version of MIUI with the TWRP recovery. Yes, you heard me right, with TWRP recovery I'll show you the method. And this method will only work if you have unlocked the bootloader of Redmi Note 3 with the official method which I have described on my channel and the link for that video will be in the description box below so check out the video for that and if you have unlocked the bootloader with the unofficial method then this method may not work for you guys so remember that before we get started let's go into settings then go into about phone and as you can see the MIUI version is 7.1.8.0 and the update for this version is the 7.2.3.0 or in your case if you are watching this video afterwards the update might be a little different so do not worry about that and guys this method will not only work on redmi note 3 but any xiaomi device which is rooted this method will work for sure so as you can see the MIUI version is this and in order to update the device to the latest build we will need 3 zip files over here so the first zip file which is present over here is the 7.2.3.0 update package and this is not the OT update package this is the full zip file and yes in order to update you will need to download the full zip file OTA updates cannot be flashed through TWRP recovery then the second zip file which is present over here is a lazy flasher zip file this will disable the DM verity check or uh, because of this zip file you will not need to flash any type of modified boot image in order to root the device so that is really a great thing then the third zip file which we have over here is a super SD zip file which is required to root the device so let's go into update our application select these three dots select reboot to recovery mode select reboot now and now the device will boot into the TWRP recovery so as you can see we have successfully booted into the TWRP recovery uh, and now you can back up the ROM for safety purposes but I'm not going to do that because I know that this method is going to work and after that go into wipe select advanced wipe select cache and dalvik cache or dalvik slash art cache over here select swipe to wipe after that go back go back once again go back select install now and now select the 7.3.0 zip file which is the update which we want to flash on this device select swipe to confirm flash and the zip file will get flashed in some minutes so the update installation is complete now once again go back now select the beta super sd zip file if you want to root the device then select this zip file and select swipe to confirm flash once the zip file is flashed go back once again now select the lazy flasher zip file and it is extremely important to flash this zip file otherwise your device will not boot so remember to flash this zip file after flashing everything so select swipe to confirm flash over here this zip file will get flashed in matter of seconds and once that is done go ahead and select reboot system and if you get anything like uh, do you want to install super su then select do not install over there if and guys this method will not only work on redmi note 3 but all xiaomi devices so if you have mi5 or redmi note 3 mediatek variant or redmi 3 this method will work for sure but the only thing is that you will need to download zip file of your respective device the full zip file which i'm talking about and i'll give a direct download page link of miui forum in the description box below from where you can download that zip file but sometimes the zip file is not directly available or it takes few days to appear on that download page so you will have to search a little bit on miui forums or xda forums for the complete zip file so remember to do that if you are not able to find the updated zip file of your phone so guys as you can see we have successfully booted into the system and if i use my fingerprint over here then the device will get unlocked so fingerprint sensor is working so first of all go, let's go into settings then go into about phone and as you can see 7.3.0 so miui version is 7.2.3.0 or to be precise the phone has been updated via TWRP recovery and root access is also present over here so super su is present over here which means the root access is also enabled for the device so yes this is how you can update your redmi note 3 or any xiaomi device via TWRP recovery and if you guys have any type of doubts suggestions or queries regarding this video then let me know about that in the comment section below i'll surely try to answer your queries and I have made many more videos on the Redmi Note 3 and many more are going to come real soon on the channel. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. So yeah, this is pretty much it for this video guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button if you like this video and let's see if we can reach triple five likes on this video. So yes, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more awesome videos. So yeah, thank you guys. Thank you for watching.